Last week on Thai Times, I visited the Rajamangala National Stadium in Bangkok to support the Thai national football team when they faced off against Vietnam. I was welcomed by everyone, whether or not they knew I was half Thai. I quickly made new mates at the football. They invited me to join them at their local football ground to have a few friendly games. I felt this had helped me to further see why the Thai people love their sport so much. So I had to check out one of Bangkok's finest seven-a-side football courts. And of course, to get there, I had to take a win motorcycle. So I had arrived at Happy FC, surrounded by restaurants, condominiums, state-of-the-art facilities. It was truly a great place to go and have a kick of the footy. But I wasn't too keen, I just wanted to be a spectator for the first part of this night. Things were looking a bit physical, but I gave myself some time and was keen to go out and represent Australia. I started out in the middle. First touch, not bad, keeping the intensity and concentration up. Second touch, tackled. Third touch, well that wasn't really a touch and oh, not not even close. Couple of, couple of good touches in there. Yeah. Maybe one good touch. Uh, regardless, the foot bond continued. Thought I'd give defense a shot. I'm not gonna lie, I, I can't stay back without bolting up the field to have a shot. It, it's a shame the ball is going faster than me most of the time. It's hard to see, but I did get one shot away here. I forced a corner, I was pretty happy with that. I'm not sure what cultural lesson I was learning here. I, I think the only thing I was gathering is that I'm shocking at football. At least my mates weren't critical. Don't worry, I recovered from my injury and was straight back into my hot form. Oh, superstar, if you in Thai, superstar. Premier League, okay? As you can see, I'm, I'm pretty injured. The big boy hit me. Um, uh, I run man, I run man. It's alright, it's alright. I'll survive, I'll survive. Ah, uh, it's a pretty nasty injury. Oh, it's on the floor. Looks like I'm gonna pick up an STD now. Oh. Now back to pointless sprinting and clueless kicking. Oh, hey, got a tackle. The guy in the grey shirt here actually played in the Thai Premier League at one stage and oh there it is, my first international goal. Yeah that went in and who cares if it was an own goal. I tried out one last position, goalkeeper. Save off camera and here comes the rebound, saved by Rajna Pinto. Again, Son, uh, my new Thai mate, was supportive as ever. <laughs> they were so impressed, they put me in goal again. The hot streak of elegant touches and illegal handling of the ball made me the ideal goalie. And there went my clean sheet. So a half-time street food snack was in store and Son had something special for me to eat. Chicken feet. Okay, a bit better prepared here. All kitted up with fancy shoes, shin pads. Was I a new man? No, no, still as useless as ever. Dad, what you doing? But in the end, despite my poor form, the name of the club is Happy FC and these guys who I befriended insisted I took this shirt from their local club. Apparently, I'm the captain now. We called it a night and my mate Nam here got real close with his fellow teammates. Keep in mind the bloke on the top here is this show's Thai camera operator. So the night was coming to a close and it was photo time and what could I take from this? Any cultural learning? Any journeys into my Thai heritage? No. No, not at all. I knew I was a shit footballer and now I have video proof. Well, that's all we had time for. Now off to Kruchery who was with me at the time when I was keen to learn some more basic Thai conversation. Get around. So first of all, it's really important if you need to go to the toilet. So you want to know where the toilet is, yeah. right? So you need to ask people where the toilet is. It's really, really easy, Kun Daniel. Okay. All you need to do is just put the place where you want to go and put the word Yu Tinai. I've heard that before. 
Yes. For example, MBK, the best shopping mall in Bangkok. Cool. You can just say MBK. You Tinai. You Tinai. Chai ka. Okay, well, here's one for you. What if I have to take a taxi somewhere? Yeah. How do I hail a taxi? What do I say to him? How do I give him money? Okay, so first of all, you go into the taxi, you just say, Pom, ya, bai, and then the place where you want to go. For example, we just keep it as MBK. So you say, Pom, ya, bai, MBK, club. Okay. And what does that directly translate to? It means that I want to go to. MBK. Ah, uh, okay. So pom, I for the for the male. Yep. If you're a female, you say chan, yak, yak okay. means want, and pai means go. So pom yak pai, and then where you wanna go. All right. Here's another one for you. I've been taken to the shopping center by the taxi driver, and I need to pay in baht. Now, how would I go about paying him if I barely speak p a t h a Thai? Yeah, so when you ask people how much, you just say h o w r a i k a p Okay. h o w r a i k a p Or another way, there's a two way to say. You can say k i b a t k a p So you put the word k i and then the currency. So for example, if it's in Australian dollar, you just say k i dollar k a p But of course, you have to put it in Thai accent. You can't just say dollar. <laughs> you just say dollar. <laughs> you know that's a Thai accent. Okay, so I can't just show up and say k i dollar, mate. I have to structure it and sentence and make my sentence sound very Thai in a way. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. Uh, some of my friend went to Thailand, and you know he just got married with a Thai lady, and he want to call her mom as Ma. So it's like you know, cause she like uh, originally Chinese background, so they usually call their mom as Ma, 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 k a t i n g But instead of he say Ma in that Ma, <laughs> she actually say Ma. And ma mean dog, so she actually he actually call her a dog, and you know of course the whole family like, why you call my mom a dog? And he said, no, no, I don't mean to call her a dog. I try to say ma, no, but it come out like ma, so just like ma and ma, so <laughs> just be careful with the tone, นะคะ But of course, if you make a mistake, just say ขอโทษครับ and smile, and that will be okay. Hopefully, we'll see you next week and have more. Thai learning Thai, and so far I hope you enjoy. Ka, สวัสดีค่ะ Next week on Thai Ties, I'll continue to travel around Thailand, bringing you some of the most exciting and well-known hotspots, and of course, we'll check in with Khun Ron and k r u c h u r i All that and much more. See you next week, 1:30 p.m. next Sunday. สวัสดีครับ Thailand. Go on, get out of here, you bugger. Get out of here. Get out of here. What a great part of Thailand. Let's get going.